When picking up the pieces after a natural disaster, there are, of course, the wonderful stories of people helping people. And after Hurricane Laura swept through Louisiana recently, a crew from Animal World Snake Farm Zoo rolled up their sleeves, traveled down, and cleaned up. Dr. Eric Traeger joins us to fill us in on the work that they have done. Good afternoon. How are you doing, Mike? I'm doing very well, sir. So you all went in, lent a hand to a zoo in Louisiana on August 29th, Animal World Snake Farm. You loaded up a trailer full of supplies and went over there. Uh, what did you find? What was it like when you went there? Well, you know, Mike, we didn't know what we were getting ourselves into. Uh, ZDR3, which is a zoological disaster response team uh, we're a member of, called us and said that uh, Alexandria Zoo needed help. So we loaded up supplies for anything. We had water, food, welders, uh, chainsaws, anything you could think of so that we, when we arrived, we were prepared. Uh, the scene that we arrived to was uh, pretty devastating. Uh, there were a lot of just huge trees, 40 to 50 of them down all throughout the park. It was, uh, it was pretty unbelievable. So obviously, you know, when residences are damaged, people have to go in and clean up. But is it different going into a zoo? Because you have to deal with all of the animals there, obviously, right? Absolutely. And the first thing we did is we got with the Alexandria Zoo's team and, and, and they were they were amazing. They had already uh, they'd already gone through and made sure that all the animals were safe. They had zero loss of life, which is incredible with the amount of trees that were down. Um, we found we had to find out which exhibits were damaged so that we could get the animals out of their winter houses and back into those exhibits. So that was our priority. Our priority was to remove those large trees in those exhibits, mend the fences, weld things, repair them, so those animals could get back outside. How long were you all there? Uh, we were there for five days. Uh, we went in uh, with our team. The Audubon Zoo was there. Um, they arrived with us or at the same time. So there was two teams uh, plus Alexandria Zoo's team. Um, as we rolled out, San Antonio Zoo rolled in with a team of 10, and uh, they took off. Where, they took up where we left off. That's so fantastic that you all just bond together in situations like that. So how is the Alexandria Zoo doing right now? It's a lot better. They, they, still, uh, they still could use some help. Um, I know that we're on call. If we need to go back, we will. But they've, uh, you know, the city, it's a city-run zoo, and this, the entire city took a hit. They, they lost a lot of power. And so they had to focus on all those uh, all those electric lines and things like that. But now the city is also involved and, and they're jumping right in and helping out. Okay, how can people follow the progress at the Alexandria Zoo and how can they help out? So there's a, uh, there's a site that we sent to you and maybe it's up on the screen. It's uh, the Zoological Disaster Response uh, Team. And there's a, there's a GoFundMe page where um, people can donate to that will go to bring all these zoos together so when there's uh, uh, when they're needed we'll all jump in well back here at home tell us about animal world and snake farm you all are open right yes sir we're open uh we're doing well uh you know we're practicing all the safe measures of covid and uh, we've got a great team here and the, the animals are doing fantastic and it's such a fun place to go to. Tell us how folks can, can find out more about your place and where they go to get there. So our website is awsfzoo.com or awsfz, I'm sorry, .com. And you can go to our website. We've got shows every 30 minutes. Uh, we've got our interactions and uh, that, that's how you would find us. Dr. Eric Traeger, director at Animal World and Snake Farm Zoo, thank you so very much for taking the time to tell us all about all of the hard work you folks did for the zoo over there in Louisiana. Appreciate it. Thank you, sir.